Today we're looking at the Green Kids Craft Science and Craft Box and the one I have here today is the Dinosaur Discovery Box and this is box number 37. And when you open the box what you'll find is an information sheet about Green Kids Craft. Then you have a poster because every time you get one of these boxes you get a badge. And so it comes with a poster to put the badges on. And then you'll find an information sheet about what is in the kit as well as some fun facts and information on dinosaurs. And then you find your kits and there are several different kits in this one. You can make five different things and my son was very excited about this because he loves doing crafts and so when he saw this and saw that pretty much everything he needed was in the box, he was very excited because he knew that he could take this and just go with it and what little boy doesn't love dinosaurs and so he was excited to be able to do this and he didn't even realize that what he was doing was educational and so we started with the baby dinosaur excavation kit this was the one he was most excited about because basically what you're doing is making a paper mache dinosaur egg so it comes with an information sheet that tells you how to make the project and then this one had some information about dinosaurs and so we took all the materials and we got it all together and I had to help him with just a few things but most of it he could do by himself and then he got started now this one was really messy we had that glue water everywhere and it was just glue mixed with water on these strips of tissue paper but we had it everywhere so you'll want to make sure that when you have an activity like this that you have your area covered well and so once we got that one done we moved on to the paleontology kit and this was another one he was super excited about making his own fossils out of clay um, and so he had I think he had the best time with this one really he got to use creativity with the macaroni noodles and making these and I think they turned out really well in fact, when my other kids came home, they were impressed and they could even tell what dinosaurs these were. And so this one was a lot of fun for him. And now that they're dry, he can really play with them however he wants. And so here you're seeing the prehistoric pet. And this is a wooden 3D dinosaur puzzle. And this is an interesting way to decorate it because it comes with a cork and some stamp. Pad. And so you take the cork and you dip it in the ink and you stamp it all over. So it becomes this kind of cool little wooden puzzle and he gets to take credit for making it. And then it comes with a reconstruction lab and habitat kit. And so you get to make these dinosaurs out of... Um, you get to make them out of cardboard and so he was able to do that. We did use up the other glue in the first project and so we had to use our own glue but he was able to um, glue these together and he put the glitter on I didn't help him at all with these and then you take the box and you make this like a shadow box and he loved this now he has all of his projects kind of living in this box together you can see they're all there together um, and it took our egg from the first project about a day or so to dry I think we got it a little too wet but it took it about a day to dry Oh, he was very excited about this. He ripped it open and he took the dinosaur out and he put the dinosaur back in and he took the dinosaur out and he has continued to do that. And I don't think that we'll be getting rid of this egg for a long time. Um, and so, like I said, my son really learned a lot doing this. He read the information about dinosaurs um, on the cards and he compared as he was doing these, what he was doing with these crafts to what the real thing was like. For example, he compared what a real dinosaur egg might be like to his, compared to his paper mache egg. So this was a whole lot of fun. This was a really nice way for he and I to spend the weekend working together on this. And he learned a whole lot more about dinosaurs than what he knew. And so for a kid his age, this was really a nice project.